A new look to some streets in Grand Rapids and city leaders hope it makes things better for people on bicycles. 24 Hour News 8's Evan Dean is downtown tonight to show us all new at 7. If you've been through downtown Grand Rapids of late, you'll likely have noticed a new color of paint on some city streets. They're called bike boxes, and they're the city's newest effort to make things safer and more accessible for cyclists. Can we make those streets work for more people? It's a question city leaders have been asking for a long time now. Their newest answer, two green bike boxes on North Division at Lion and Pearl. Downtown GR Inc. and the city have teamed up on these, putting out a video to show how they work. Transportation Planning Supervisor Kristen Bennett demonstrated it herself today. They're allowed to come up. So this guy's here stopped on red. The bicyclists can come up move over into the box and position themselves into that left turn lane. The goal is to make cyclists more visible and help them make a left turn when traffic is heavy. Has there been any pushback from drivers? We haven't really heard anything specific about this. But we did wonder if this might slow things down for motorists, given there's already no left turn light at these intersections. So if we had that much left turning, eventually the signal might meet warrants to go to have a left turn phase. And at that point in time, so at this point in time, the fact that it doesn't means that we're able to push enough of that left turn traffic through without having that extra phase. All this is part of the Better Bikeway pilot project that launched in July. There's more green paint to highlight conflict zones between bikes and cars, and the city has added reflective posts on part of North Division to better divide cyclists from vehicles. We do hear concerns that uh, bicyclists maybe don't belong on the road, but they are a roadway user like everyone else. They pay taxes, um, and they, a lot of people need to get around on a bicycle. It's, it's their primary way of getting around. The city says they could add more of these in the future, but they want your feedback. We'll tell you how you can give that. Just head to woodtv.com. In Grand Rapids, Evan Dean, 24-Hour News 8.